today we are going to learn how to construct a tangent to a circle when the center of the circle is not given before going to do the construction first we have to know the following theorem the theorem is none other than converse of alternate segment theorem if a line is drawn through an end point of a chord of a circle so that the angle formed with the chord is equal to the angle subtended by the chord in the alternate segment then the line is a tangent to the circle it is clearly observed in the following figure that in the figure bc is a chord and c is the given point and a line is drawn which is none other than tangent of a circle and we can observe the angles formed by the chord is angle bcx and the angle formed by subtended the angle by chord bc at the alternate segment is angle bac so both angles are equal so basing on this concept we are going to draw a tangent to a circle so let us take a circle and uh, the first point is the given point and the second point third point we just uh, take those points and the first point is uh, c and the second one is d and third one is a uh, let us join the points da and uh, Uh, da is a chord and join ac and ad so in this uh, problem uh, c is the given point and we have to construct a, a tangent to the given circle passing through the point c so let us take the compass so put the point of the compass on a and let us take any radius and draw an arc joining chord ac and chord ad so like this now move the compass to the point c and draw an arc on chord c with the same radius like this it just move the compass like this now take the compass to the point the arc which we have earlier drawn on chord ac and ad and just measure the distance and again take the compass put the compass on the point uh, which uh, the chord and the arc is intersected and now draw another arc and join the point to c so this is uh, the required tangent to the given circle so basing on converse of alternate segment theorem here the two angles are equal hence uh, it must be a tangent okay